Oh, he said, you know, I feel like I was I was really locked in defensively uh, on switches and when I was in coverage, guarding on uh, isolations. Thought that I did a, a really good job and that I was one of my best defensive performances. So yeah. Definitely, I think every game I feel more comfortable and confident and understanding what I got to do and uh, where I need to be. And I think that it's only going to uh, get better from here. Yeah, I think I need uh, need to step up my rebounding overall. Um, I think that when I'm on the glass, you know, it uh, puts pressure on them, and it's also easy baskets too. So I think it's just a good thing to do, and um, I think that I'm just going to continue to do that. Yeah, definitely. Um, I think part of the reason for that is just I've been watching a lot of film. I think the films really helped me being able to see uh, what's going on and see where the defense is at. And um, I feel like that's given me more of an understanding and helped me to kind of slow down and read the game more than just uh, predetermine what I'm going to do. No, yeah, uh, we've been pretty bad in the second half for a while. I think he said the last time we actually won a second half was against New York. So that that's unacceptable. We have to be much better in that area uh, coming out in the third quarter. Um, even in that third to fourth quarter, uh, that second unit, we all we all got to be better and take accountability for that. And that's something we've known for a while. But today, tonight, we were able to um, act on that. And this is something we got to consistently do. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Zeke, uh, you were really effective tonight around the rim and also from the three-point line. Um, is it a challenge to kind of just figure out, you know, where to position yourself on the court and where to kind of make yourself the most effective? I wouldn't say it's a challenge. I think that's something I definitely improved from this year compared to last year. I feel like last year I was more flown around on that three-point line. But this year I'm, I'm playing more inside out, more of a complete game. And I think that that's just come with more experience and just me studying the game, watching film, things like that. So I think that my, my overall feel for the game and uh, understanding has improved a lot. Hi, Zeke. Uh, just in terms of that first quarter, we know uh, the Trailblazers were under strength, but how important was it to come out and set the tone straight from the off? And 41 points in the first quarter really put the Trailblazers on the back foot. Yeah, no, that first quarter was really important for us because games like these can, can really sneak up on you. You can come out slow. You can um, really take a team for granted because they don't maybe not have their best players. But uh, we knew that we had to come out and really set the tone early on and not relax, not be complacent. And I think that that first quarter really helped us and jump-started us for the rest of the game. Hi, Sig. It's Minato Torres from Peru. Congrats on the win. Sig, what was the mindset of the second unit tonight, especially with Faku leading the way with 12 assists? Yeah, I think the mindset was... Um, just to bring that energy when the, when the first unit comes out, bring that energy, have good ball movement, and really just uh, uh, run our offense. I think that Faku did a great job of initiating the offense and really facilitating getting guys open looks. I mean, he was everywhere, both offensively, defensively. And, I mean, he's our point guard for our second unit, so he definitely sets the tone for us. Hi, C. Congrats for the win and your big performance from Cordoba, Argentina. This big win is the kind of energy the team need to improve their confidence for the next games? Yeah, definitely. I think that this energy we came out with, especially in the second half, is something that we need to, to have going forward. And it needs to be something we do on a consistent basis. And when we when we start out those third quarters well, and we, we have that sustained uh 
effort, I think that we're we're unstoppable. Thanks, guys.